I am, I'm riding my stationary bike right now and I was thinking about something because, oh, so you can see I'm out of, I'm out of breath, <laughs> but I was thinking about, okay, great. I get to listen to personal development. I get to, um, you know, catch up on some emails, catch up on some text messages, right? So this is like 30, 45 minutes of me just basically my body is busy, but my mind is free. So when I first started um, building my personal business, um, one of the recommendations that I heard was turn your car into a learning university and always be listening to audio. So um, anytime you're doing any type of activity, cleaning the house, doing the dishes, um, doing laundry, driving, where your body's busy, your brain is free. And this is how you can effectively multitask and get more done. And of course you can achieve so much more when you are, when you're feeding your mind, when you're feeding your mind with great information. And, um, you know, what else could I be doing right now? I could be listening to music. Maybe I might get a little bit better of a, of a workout, but you know what? Right now is about me time. And so I was so looking forward to getting on this bike not for, the, of course, the, the endorphins of the post-workout. That's going to be great. But I was really looking forward to getting on this bike so I could get in some personal development, so I can listen to some podcasts, so I can further my personal education, so I can get smarter, so I can become more effective, so that I can have that success edge. Because I don't know about you, but I don't want to live a life of mediocrity. I want to live a life that's full and that has meaning and that feels fun <laughs> and doesn't feel stressed and so that's why I'm making this video for you today because I thought what a perfect example I tell people all the time multitasking is a myth it really is it's a myth and I used to think that in order for me to become more successful I just had to learn how to multitask better and you guys I used to be really good at it like really good at it or at least I thought but what I found is study after study research after research has taught us that multitasking is a myth you can only truly focus on one thing at a time so um, I'm just going to encourage you today if you want to multitask there is one way to do it there is one way to multitask. You have to couple a brain activity with a body activity. So a mind activity with a mindless activity. Now if you're first learning to drive, of course that's not a mindless activity, but sooner or later you go on autopilot, right? First couple times you do loads of laundry. That's not a mindless activity, but sooner or later you go on autopilot. So the deal is always be learning, always be listening, catching up on podcasts, audios, personal development, things like that, right? So when whatever's going to occupy your brain, you can do something else with your body. So that's one of the reasons I love this time on the stationary bike. Here's what you can't do. Email and listening to an audio, right? Anything that's going to consume your brain, um, two conversations at the exact same time simultaneously and completely 100% comprehend exactly what people are telling you, you, you know, you know, you can't do it. Whew, I'm really starting to sweat now. Anyways, that's my tip for you today. If you truly want to multitask, there is only one way to do it, and that is to combine a mindful activity with a mindless activity. And that is one way that you can give yourself a competitive edge, and you can learn so much more, right? So just think about it. Think about, here's, here's my tip for you today. Think about all of the things that you do that require your brain. Driving, like I'm doing right now, stationary bike, um, even, you know, recently I got uh, waterproof headphones so that I can, go, when I'm swimming, I can be listening to something as at the same time. Think about all of those things that you can do and you can combine that. Even if you spend 10 minutes a day in the car, that's a competitive edge that most people don't take. Have a beautiful day, bye-bye.